So we are here with Brandon Camella. Is that how you say it last Camellia. name? Camellia. Camellia. Yeah. Sorry, I thought it was Camella. Yeah, but we are in his Mark IV R32. And uh, what what kind of setup you have in here? Uh, what kind of turbo and how big it is it? Well, it's been a long process. I mean, I got this car brand new in 2004 when it was unknown to the general public uh -huh. and to the VW dealers. And I actually came across the pond because of a petition done on VW Vortex back in 2003. Uh -huh. I was one of those petitioners. And it came around, came over, and people knew about it because of that petition. Uh, you know, enthusiasts that really knew VW and really wanted this car over it. They, they, they knew about it. But the engine got rebuilt. That's when I decided, boom, I want the turbo. And that was when HPA was sourcing for Borg Warner at this new turbo. You know, they dropped um, Garrett and stuff and, mm -hmm. and went with Borg Warner because it was new technology, the EFR zero. It makes huge torque down low. I mean, huge in comparison. I was like, yeah, I want that, you know, because I didn't have a turbo on this car ever. That was his first, his first turbo on it. But then I just, you know, I was like, oh, am I going to keep this car? And I, I just couldn't stop loving the car. Every time I drove it, it was like, <laughs> yep. I get rid of it. And I still get it. It's like almost 13 years later. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, to keep my interest with the car, I got to keep putting new things on it, you know, making it faster with yeah. clutch. Mm -hmm. It's rated for 578 torque to the crank. Um, and a few times up top, like third, fourth, fifth, maybe fourth and fifth, I smelt burning clutch uh, wide open throttle. you got on this car? Uh, it's KW uh, V3s and uh, big, uh, Neo Speed uh, front and rear uh, sway bars that are 25 okay. mils, millimeter. Um, the rear uh, strut brace I have is from uh, Chris Levin who uh, originally designed the first one, I think this was the first one when Tomas Ford Tuning was in uh, Richmond. Uh, and we put that in and this was the first iteration and that was like 2005 I want to say Wow! but that thing really stabilized the back it just firmed it up real hard it's right behind the, the back seat mm -hmm. and it just bolts the, the two uh, sides together uh, where you know where the back seat flips in yeah to the, to the, to the, to the clips Okay, I've got, um, well, HPA, obviously, it's a big one. You know, I gotta give them props for the kit. Um, United More Sports, Jeff Atwood. Um, incredible tune. Best tune, period. Bar none. Tomas Sport Tuning, who originally did the install. Um, they did it, you know, they worked on it really hard for a long time. Get Singer Motor Works in Kona. Uh, Matt and Company. Those guys just find stuff and they iron it out. Very efficient. All right, thanks. Yeah. Thank you yeah. for the experience and Good Bye, for, the, for the ride and checking out your car. Yeah. It's beautiful. Oh. It's like a new pinnacle of speed has been reached. <laughs>